and as India gears up for parliamentary elections in the spring, Facebook has begun confirming advertisers' identities and locations, and next month, it will put all electoral ads in a searchable online library. Facebook announced those measures in December and it told Reuters it will also be introducing versions of them in the European Union ahead of its elections in May. Facebook began implementing these policies after it became clear groups had used its platform to sow political discord in the lead-up to the 2016 U.S. presidential election. Last year, it started verifying advertisers in the U.S., disclosing who purchased political ads and archiving those ads online. It has expanded those rules elsewhere as well, though these policies haven't gone without their own bugs. Katie Harbeth, Facebook's director of global politics and outreach, told Reuters that the different policies region to region are due to the different local laws in each area and are influenced by the conversations the company has had with various governments and organizations in those regions. However, Facebook is looking